going to explore new coffee shops in Paris. One new coffee shop. Actually, I actually wanted to go to the Telescope Cafe. It's very, I don't know, it's becoming popular in many bloggers uh, who write and film about Paris. They always have this cafe and I wanted to explore, but it's closed. It's actually on vacant on vacation. It's pretty common in Paris in August to for small businesses to be closed. Um, so I'm going to explore another one which is called Noir. It's um, a coffee roaster. For me it's important the coffee shop to you. If <laughs> they roast the coffee it's great. It means that the coffee must be good. Um, so let's go. And I decided to take uh, the scooter. Like I, I saw the itinerary, and it's like 15 minutes by scooter, electric bike, and like more than 30 minutes by public transport. One hour by walking, <laughs> so I decided to take the scooter. Uh, I've never taken that before, so I want to give it a try and probably even buy an electric scooter or electric bike myself so that I can commute to work easily because commuting to work takes the same for me, the place where I live, the place where I work. Uh, for me, the place from where I live to the place where I work, it takes around 35-40 minutes by public transport, the same time by scooter. And I thought it's a cool opportunity to enjoy Paris and not be stuck in the metro. So sometimes there are like bike lanes, as you can see. But sometimes they aren't. There was a parking spot for scooters just very, very close to <laughs> the coffee was good, but uh, I know the barista, she, she made it too hot, so I even burned a little bit my tongue, so I think that's not okay. Um, I would say, yeah, it's generally good, but my favorite is still Lomi. <laughs> Nobody beat it. Uh, this is my favorite coffee shop in Paris, even though it's located, the location is not the best one, but... <laughs> It's still my favorite place and I don't know in this cafe how they make it in winter because uh, I didn't find any like they have tables only outside they have some small spaces like for two three people inside uh, even though it's cute like I really liked the interior design but it's too small uh, coming back to the video about things I, I hate about Paris is that all of the spaces are too small. Check it out, I'll put the link in the description, this video. And they have the space downside, but they, it's like, they keep milk there and other stuff. I don't think that they make it, that they make the space, the place to sit in, in winter and I don't know, it doesn't seem cool to sit there.
so I'm in the Luxembourg Gardens. I really love this park. It's beautiful. And if we compare it to Chilery Garden, which I really love as well, but Luxembourg Gardens at the same time, it's like Chilery touristy, but there is the areas like that where uh, there are no tourists here. Like, I mean, there are people, but not too many. I'll show you the, the areas of Luxembourg Gardens where it's, there are too many people, it's in the heart of the park. And coming back to the story with uh, the scooters, electric scooters, <laughs> for me it finally cost a lot, like 10 euros per ride. And it took 30 minutes because, first of all, for 5 minutes I couldn't understand how to unpark it, but my fault. Um, it took me like four five minutes to do that and the second thing is that I didn't know the route so I always had to stop for a while and check the right direction or not sometimes I took the wrong direction so I'm a person who for who is not easy to orient in the new areas when you take the other route not as usual so <laughs> That's why at the end it might cost you more. And what else I wanted to say about electric scooters and bikes? I want, first of all, I want to try different uh, bike and scooter sharing systems. Uh, so far I tried Lime and I was thinking about either rent an electric bike uh, from, there is a service called Valley Go. So they actually send you the electric bike and you pay like 40 or 30 euros per month, so which is not a big deal. Uh, but I'm not sure about bikes because it's uh, more difficult to park. It's easier to park a scooter to, to take it with you. You can go to restaurants, it's, uh, it doesn't take much place, so you can put it in the apartment. Um, so I'm, um, and I prefer honestly scooters. <laughs> it's cute, the toilets. <laughs>